Okay, hi everyone. This is Rusia. This is Niam. I'm Miss Elza. And we're going to do tutorial on learning eight notes. Niam has some trouble counting eight notes. And today is a good uh, time to start, get serious about counting out loud and count ends, the word end for eight notes, okay? So before we do songs, let's just simply first count one of those songs with no eight notes, just simply uh, quarter notes, right? Or we can even do this one. Don't play, tap for me and give me the rhythm. Give me just counts. One, this one. One, two, no ends. Three, four, continue. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. What was here, Mia? It was rest. So when we have a rest, we lift hand, we don't touch surface, we don't touch the key, we don't have sounds, we have silence, right? So this was your three, yeah? the noise. Four is silence. Continue. One, One two, three, four. And you say four. It's beat number four. Okay, do the next one. Number three, and this is uh, your right hand. Now use your right hand. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Good. So this is going to be your assignment for a sight reading level one. Early elementary by Paul Harris. This, I'm going to give you assignment. Don't play. Just tap the rhythm for this one. Okay. Now we're going to do this winning rhythm book. Who is published by KGOS Music Corporation by Edward Ayola. Winning rhythms. We're going to jump to chapter 3, page 4. It's where eight notes starts. Do you see eight notes? Two notes under a beam. Yeah. Right? So we're going to tap each single note. Right? And for every other note, we're going to add the word end. So it's going to be one and two and three and four and. Okay? Can you bring for me those pencils? Oh, bunch of them. Thank you. Now I want you to show me. Where's the one? Where's the end? One, one and two. You got it. Good job. Now two. you tap and count. Thank you. One and two and three and four and five. Oh my goodness. Five. Where's the five guy? Oh. One. Stop, stop, stop. There is might be such a time signature which has a five quarter notes in a bar or six quarter notes in a bar. Possibly. I never saw it in my life. But I mostly play classical music. Uh, some kind of atonal, abstract, arrhythmical music might have such a very weird, uh, strange for our ears and understanding rhythms possible but for us where we start new count where is the new one it starts after the bar line right so bar line means when we have this bar separated with the line and how do we know it's uh, four beats in a bar how do we know it's three or four or two where it does it say four but four. four by four yeah, well, look at this four by four, kind of four by four, right? Four times four. Okay, sounds strange. This calls a time signature. We always look at 
these numbers and we know it's four beats in a bar. Each bar has a four beats. For example, here, it's going to be only two beats in the bar. See number two? So time signature tell us. In this, your songs, how many beats? Uh, where I saw this? Mm, mm, not here. I saw somewhere three. Okay, let's find here. Here. How many beats in the bar? Three. Three. So this is kind of what we're going to use for now. Two beats, three beats, four beats. Okay? And there's another number in the time signature underneath of the top four. What is the on the bottom? This four. And it's everywhere. Four, 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 four. There's no variation. What this four stands? Uh, how many we already beats said how many we already said four beats in a measure what about that four this four tells us each beat equal equals two two beat. two measures <laughs> you're so creative it is equals to one what is it no what is it? A quarter note. Thank you. So it equals to one quarter note. Each beat equals to one quarter note. And if you look, two eight notes, they equals to one quarter note. Right? Remember we did some, don't fall, Rus is pushing you. Uh, we did this um, pizza or pie. And when we divide it into half we had a half note half note when we divide it into four parts we had a four slices four slices so this is our quarter note so if we divide each slice of quarter we're going to have how many slices one two three four five six seven eight, seven, eight. exactly so this is our eight uh, note slice two eight note slices they make together one 18 one quarter note. note yeah i know it's complicated so now because we have um counts one two three four one two three four each quarter note gets one beat gets four beats in the bar right clap for me and count one, one two clap and count yeah just clap. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Keep going. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Good. So we have now more notes. So what we're going to say right here. And. Exactly. Here's a pencil. You write put a like little plus it's gonna stand for the word end very good so now you clap for me and don't forget to say acknowledge each note with the word one and two and can you do it Go. one and Two and three and four and one and two and three and four and very good. So um can you guess when we get a quarter notes, for example? Where's the end? In between? Uh -huh. So it goes after three, right? So the quarter note gets three and, right? Next quarter note gets four and. and. Okay, now keep writing eight notes. One and two and three. Let me see. And uh -huh. four and. Wow, you become expert now in the eight notes. Can you call for me the second? Um, uh, simple B mm -hmm. one and two 
and three and four and five and five. Did you say five? I mean one and two and three and four and Okay. Should you go up right here or not? No. No, because it was quarter not, right? Okay, now let's check one with the eight mm, with the half knot. Okay. One where's the end? Two where's the end? Mm -hmm. Three. Let me count as quarters. Three, four. And you figure out where's the ends. No. Yeah, don't go to the next bar. We're still in the first bar. <laughs> this is next bar. We cannot go to the... Yeah. It's like you're going to the next... Another so, room. It so goes right after four. Yep. What about this? After three, you forgot to write after three. Yeah? So the half knot, three and four and... Yes? Can you clap and count? One and two, three. Say two, and, don't and forget. Three. No. You clap one time. Your note is one time. It's quarter note, right? But it's continued. Two and. If we have a two eight notes, we'll do two and. We would play two and. But it's quarter, uh, quarter notes. So it's two and. Equals to by timing, it's equals to eight notes, but by sound, it's one sound, right? Okay, try again. Clap one and two and three and four. Continue and one, then two and three and four. No, 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 the five. same thing you. Hold half note for three and four and right. Do it again. One, One and, and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. And Good job. Now I want you play for me. Pick one single note and play the last bar for me. I'm gonna write for you and you play just this one bar. Play and count. One, one and one and two. Where, where are you? Are you here? Oh, yeah. This is the note. So it's one and one and two and oh yeah, it's a quarter note. Okay, go back. First bar from A. Go. One and two. One first bar from B. One and two and three and four. Stop, 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 stop. Do you see the difference between yeah. this? Yeah? So what do you see? This is quarter. Yeah, this is quarter note. That's an eighth note. So what you did wrong? Um, I, I you did played, too quick. You, you played the note right here. Like here's the eighth note, eighth note, right? But... It's count for eight note, but there's no note. Note is just one. Three and give me your third finger. Four and yes, do it again by yourself. One and you one and two and three and four. Good, you got it. Now give me the first bar of C. Mm -hmm. One and two and three and four. You got it. You see, now we have different rhythm, right? The count goes like a clock. One and two and three and four and. It's all the same. Beats the same. But if you hear the notes, what we create, it's a rhythm. It's a different, right? Okay. So we're going to focus on assignment for the rhythm. You're going to do the same thing. All your assignments, you're going to work top. If you have a song for right and left hand, like this, for example, or you're going to clap if it's single, single line. 
let's say bye my goodness 15 minutes video tutorial for nia how old are you nia nine he's nine he just started we have um difficulties with the rhythm so we're focusing on this task bye niam can use the video and someone can okay. also hopefully use our video tutorial turn it off please